I've been making videos showcasing the secrets in Noita since the very first day of Early Access over a year ago. During this entire time, almost all of this has had one thing in common. They've all already been solved. But today's video will introduce some of you to one of two entirely unsolved mysteries in this game. The Mystery of the Eye Glyphs. These first started to be discovered soon after the game left Early Access. A series of strange eye symbols arranged into rows, each eye's pupil in one of five orientations. Center, up, down, left, or right. The point of this video is to put out a call to action to you guys in the community to help finally solve this. If you or anyone you know has experience with cryptography, cryptanalysis, code breaking, what have you, then join the official Noita community discord server. There's a link down below in the description, and I'll also pin a comment with the link. Then you can ask a moderator for access to the iRoom, where all the work on this is being done. We figure that getting the word out and then directing everyone to one centralized location will help get this solved that much quicker, instead of information about this being scattered around all over the internet. Now, what is it that we know about these? Concrete knowledge. Well, there are nine sets of them across East and West parallel worlds. This image is just an example. The eye locations seem to be seed-based, so they most likely will not be in these exact spots for you. This is just to illustrate that if you were to find one in Westworld, there would be a corresponding one in that exact spot in Eastworld. All except for West 5, as there are only four eye locations in Westworld. One theory for this is that the location where West 5 would be is either a trigger or the site we have to go to after solving the first nine messages. Keep in mind that all nine eye sequences are different, despite corresponding with one another. So quite a bit of information can be encoded within them all. Also, none of this is present in the easily extracted data file. It's hard-coded into the engine itself, making it far more difficult to data mine. As I'm demonstrating in this clip, the eyes will not spawn until you trigger the loading message for the biome they're in, so you can easily walk right past them and not even know it. In the beginning, some people thought that these might have been a bug, but far too much has been learned about them to hold on to that belief as is the case with another recently discovered and unsolved secret, the eyes will not spawn at all if any mods have been enabled in your run, not even if you turn them off and reload your save. But there is a way around this, as is detailed in this document by Xkeeper, along with everything else we know about the eyes. Everything I've mentioned in this video, trigrams, vision air theory, frequency analysis, etc. And yes, I know a lot of people commented about this when I mentioned the eyes before in a previous video, and it seems like an obvious first thing to try, treating the entire thing as one big Konami code and pressing the directions the eyes are looking. It's been done. We've been trying to solve this for six months now, so let's all come together as a community and let's do this. If you're interested, again, check out the iRoom channel on the Noita Discord, link down below. I'll also put a link down there for the Xkeeper document so you can see all this information in text form. Alright guys, I know this was a pretty short video, but I just wanted to get this information out and I wanted to put this call to action out. Let's solve this thing, guys. It's one of two unsolved mysteries in this entire game. Maybe this will lead to even more secrets that we didn't even know the existence of. Anyway, alright. Thank you, and hopefully I see you in the eye room. Let's do this.